Hey guys, my name is Ismas. Welcome to my channel, Top Channel 101. So this is a follow-up video on my uh, last video on how to make money online selling stock images and 3D models. Uh, so the stock images I'm talking about are just renders that I make in Blender. Uh, so what I do is, uh, I explained this better in the last video, but I just want to uh, recap uh, for those who may not have watched that. So what I do, I model a 3D uh, object like this. Uh, so I don't just model one model like this. I just I model a scene like this. So I'm trying to do this scene uh, so that I have uh, a theme I'm going for. So I'll model this mirror, uh, this desk, uh, table, uh, sorry, the chair, the, the bed, and everything that is in there. And then try to render the scene. Uh, maybe I'll change a few things uh, so that I'm not copyright. I'm not uh, infringing on someone's copyright. Uh, maybe change a few things and uh, so that I render something. Out that looks uh, good. If uh, if the render comes out realistic, I sell that image uh, on uh, a stock uh, website, image stock uh, stock websites uh, as a stock image. Uh, so yeah, this is just a progress on uh, how that is going so far. Uh, so I did a few uh, models here. I don't know. Let me just go to the website. Uh, so. I saw, I made these models, I made this, and uh, the render came out, I think, realistic, so I, I put it up on uh, Shutterstock, sorry, on Adobe Stock, and uh, and I also made this scene in Blender, uh, it's like an architecture scene, and this here, I submitted the, mod, uh, the rendered images as stock images, and uh, fortunately, uh, they got approved, uh, and you can see these are, these are all in my portfolio, uh, but for some reason, uh, I made uh, two renders of this. A so the, the three renders uh, in different angles. So this one was approved, this one was approved, but uh, the third one was rejected uh, because of copyright issues. Uh, what I was told is that, uh, let me f see if I can find that. Okay, so this is the image. You can see it's the same image, but in a different angle. What I was told is that uh, because of the logo, the texture I added on the step measure, uh, it can't be submitted as a stock image uh, for copyright reasons. Uh, but uh, it is very confusing because uh, this image as well shows that logo, and uh, I think it's more clearer than this, but uh, it was approved, but uh, this one was not. And you can see in intellectual property because there is a logo or something. Yeah, so uh, this one was also uh, not approved. I don't know why, maybe because it wasn't, it didn't come out, maybe the render didn't come out very well, or I don't know, they, didn't, they don't really give you uh, that much information uh, about why uh, that was rejected. Rejected. You can see here, yeah, they're, they're just giving me uh, the reason here as a technical uh, issue, and uh, for this, you can see intellectual pro property uh, refusal, and uh, are, they don't really show, give you a reason here. Uh, this is just a copy and paste uh, something generic they send to you that uh, there is a trademark. There. So I went on uh, uh, to Google and see if I could find a reason for why uh, this was rejected. And uh, they, <clears throat> what I read was that uh, if you have any logos like a half here on this step measure, which was just a texture, uh, I actually did this in, photo, in Photoshop. So it's not a logo of any company, but it was rejected because uh, there is a logo in that. And uh, uh, for this, I'm not sure what, they're just telling me there is a technical issue, but I think it was because either the render did, they didn't, uh, either the render was not as realistic or sometimes uh, the image can be rejected because it doesn't really serve a purpose. Uh, because you want to, because they, uh, in some of the terms, I think, or recommendations are for stock images you, sh you should upload, uh, one of the reasons is that uh, the image you, you upload has, has to serve a purpose and I think this one doesn't really serve uh, that much purpose for someone who wants uh, stock images but uh, this as you can see if I so you can see these are in the reject rejected uh, section uh, I have nothing in review uh, but uh, let me see releases I don't think there is anything here uh, but uh, if I go in my portfolio this 
uh, this is what is in my portfolio and uh, they are up <coughs> for sale right now i haven't made any sales uh, here but i also don't expect uh, that much uh, from se selling stock images because from my understanding uh, you need to have a lot of images to make any sales and uh, you have to be uploading constantly and you see, and you know these are 3d renders uh, they really take a lot of time so that is uh, the stock images uh, so i'll go to my other uh, portfolio uh, sorry for my to my uh, to cg traders to cg trader where i'm selling my 3d models <coughs> so i made i think uh, this month uh, uh, this uh, this month i have sold uh, two models so uh, this tape me i've sold a tape measure uh, this uh, this one here so as i said when i'm making the 3d models i make i don't just make one model i make a scene like this and then i uh, sell the individual models models are uh, separately so i would sell uh the helmet <coughs> the helmet are uh, separately are uh, from the coffee cup uh, and also i would sell the tape measure separately and that's what i did uh here, so I sold the tape measure separately from the other elements, and you can see I've already got a sale from that. So it, I'm selling them very cheaply, uh, two dollars. But uh, you can see uh, after the payment, the uh, payment processing and uh, taxes and what, and reality fees, I get about one dollar and uh, eighteen cents. Uh, for the I also sold a fire hydrant uh, that was in the beginning of this month, uh, also for three dollar, three dollars. Uh, minus payment uh, processing and taxes I remain with about one dollar so this is my sales let me show you some of my uh, published models just to give you an idea of what I'm trying to do <coughs> so you can see in this image here uh, there is a helmet uh, there is the tape measure which has already sold and there is that concrete mixed mix uh, mixer so I also sell, I also render out uh, those objects separately and then I sell them as, as stock images uh, like you see here. I sold, I'm putting up this as a separate image from the other, uh, for the entire scene. And then let's go back to CG Trader. Uh, let me, uh, let's see, let's see, that modified. So you can see. I'm also selling the entire scene, uh, including all the 3D models at a different price. I'm selling them very cheaply. You can see $5. So I'm selling the entire scene, every model included here. Let's see. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm selling it very cheaply for $5 just to, so that I can get a sale and see what is selling and what is not. Uh, so this is the tape measure that sold and you can see it's also included in this scene. I, I'm selling it for $2 and uh, also have the concrete mixer up uh, for $2 as well. It hasn't sold and I, yeah, so I also made this scene here. This scene here, you can see it's just a, a home office setup. Uh, I'm selling it as a collection, but I'm also selling it, I'm selling different items from that as independently. So you can see the office chair. I'm also selling the mouse, it's also included there. Uh, and let me see if I can get a render for that. Yeah, I wanted to put this as a, as a, a stock image uh, in my stock image website uh, portfolio but uh, I didn't think the renders the render came out very good because it's it's not packed it doesn't look re realistic to me so I just uh, decided maybe I just sell it as a 3d package instead of uh, selling the renders uh, on as, as stock images yeah so that's where I'm at uh, you can see the 3d uh, fire hydrant here uh, that's sold you can see in the orders I have it uh, as sold and I sold it for uh, and I earned uh, one dollar from that it's not a lot of money but uh, yeah I'm, I'm really not going to be uh, if I just keep them in my library